so in this video I will install a new Angular version and create a new version, a new project with this uh, version inside, the new version inside. So we open for installation of Angular and the basics. It's uh, we open our command. So we go in here, Windows button, and then input for administrator, and we see a window like this, and then we say. Um, what's my command? We say npm install global um, at Angular, Angular, and then front slash CLI, and then we add the version on there. So we say add version 17. The current version is 18. So and installed is the version 16. So we say this one. So then we have different versions in it. So and now we say we go into our uh, to our project in here. We open that folder here. This demo folder. Uh, we say open visual code. Now we are in this folder. Create a new folder, terminal, new terminal. That's the blank folder. And now we first say um, ng version. So we see we are in version 17. That's great. And not 16 as before. And from there we say. Uh, we uh, create a new version, uh, a new app, which is called uh, Angular 17 test image. And we say CSS is okay. Do you want uh, server-side rendering? This is new. Uh, in came up in version 17. And we say static generation, and this might also cause my other uh, problems. So we say yes, great. And as you see here on our on this version, you see there's the Angular block in here. And there comes the node modules, and that's the important stuff. The node modules is not that global stuff, it's inside that uh, folder. These are, that's version uh, binded. And now, what we do, we change to that folder. Open that integrated folder, now we say ng-surf. Now that's different now. You see this uh, new writing there. Before it was one liner. And we say also again, we open the localhost. We get a page, localhost, and the page is different. And what we check now, especially, is um, as you see here under source, assets, there's no file in there. Um, and I drop a new file from my previous uh, project in there. So, le or let's say from here, uh, a new different stuff, Angular, source, assets. And now I take a, a new picture. It's a, let's say we have a code behind machine uh, library where all these uh, resources are coming in. And we drop this picture by code, by background service into the new assets folder. Now we have a new picture in there and the picture also arrives here. And the trick is now, will it be visible? The test one, it will not be, yeah, that's the new stuff, the message, the error message, and maybe it works with assets. Also not, and so 
the error comes from in this new version that it's not available uh, when you have new stuff and uh, behind there when we say uh, okay we close that stuff and when we, we say control C for breaking then we say please start new with this with this file inside and when we start it now again and now you see this one again and when we run it now you see after doing the uh, the the new binding well, or building with and with ng surf then the this file will, will be visible afterwards and when you do now uh, another when you add now on the background new files for example they will not be visible also they should now a second file was created when I go there and say hey my do it my dear asset stuff show and then I get the same problem unfortunately this is an error coming up from version uh, 15 uh, version 16 to 17 and 18